You can create better images than mid-journey because I will tell you three free image generators. If you use these three tools, you can definitely create better images than mid-journey. At the end of the video, I have a fourth bonus tool for you. Each has its pros and cons. The first tool is Microsoft Bing or Microsoft Designer. You can freely access it with a Microsoft account. Enter a prompt and click on Create. It has created four different images. Let's talk about its pros and cons. It is totally free. It generates high quality images. You can access it through the web, which means you don't have to join a Discord server like Midjourney. You cannot choose the model. You have to put text in anime style or 3D style. You cannot upgrade one specific image. You cannot change the ratio of images, it just generates images in squares. You cannot enter negative prompts. The conclusion is that it is a basic image generator. The second tool is Focus. Its code is available on GitHub. There are two methods to use Focus Collab. The first is to download it on your computer, but you need a heavy PC with a graphics card. You can watch this complete tutorial to download it. My suggestion is the second method, which is to use Google Collab. It means that the code will run on Google's computer and you will use it on your device. This process is a bit complicated and most people own a phone, not a PC. So, let's move to the phone screen to use it. First of all, open Google Chrome and search for Focus Collab. Open this first website. Click on the menu button, then run time and run all. Now wait. It takes two minutes to load all the code. Now it has generated a link that you can use for 72 hours. Click on this link. This is the Focus interface. Click on three dots and enable desktop site. You can copy the link and also use it on other devices. Click on the input image. Here you can upscale the image, face swap the images, in paint and a lot of other options. Click on advanced. Here you can choose the ratio of the image. In styles, there are hundreds of styles. You can change the model but I would suggest the default model. On advanced, you can choose the guidance and image sharpness. Let's generate a simple image. I personally like the relativism of the image. Let's discuss its pros and cons. It is open source, which means no restrictions and limits. Open source means free for everyone and forever. Most realistic image generators ever. A lot of options and flexibility. It is very slow. If you run it on Google Collab, it would show an error if you put a little heavy load on it. The third tool is Playground AI. Sign up using your Google account. Now on the left side, click on Filter. There are also a lot of different models. Enter a prompt. Here is the option to enter a negative prompt. It already has put the necessary prompts. You can also upload images as a prompt. On the right side, choose a present means real world or fancy world. Choose a model. Here you can change the ratio of the images and many more options. Now click on Generate. It automatically changed the prompt to a professional prompt. Let's generate another image. It again changed the prompt. Let's discuss its pros and cons. It is fast. You can easily access through its website. It allows you to generate 100 images per day in a free trial. It automatically upgrades your prompt. Its quality is low compared to Focus. Its images are not realistic like Focus. The fourth bonus tool is Leonardo AI. It provides 150 credits per day. It offers various other features, such as image upscaling, image extending, and image-to-video conversion. 